Hey everyone, we're here with episode not are we on nine now? I think. I think yeah, yeah I think it's nine because um, ten is the uh, season finale. So this is episode nine of Total Diva season two. This is a review, but before I begin, kind of a few things happened this week uh, yeah. in like <laughs> wrestling world that we should probably talk oh, about. Really. Um. Number one, oh. number one being uh, Daniel Bryan, uh, WWE World Heavyweight Champion, uh, has broken his neck and yeah. had to get a surgery done on Ooh. Thursday. Happy to report it's a successful surgery. He'll only be out for a couple months and not the full year as yes. people like yes. Yes. Edge, <laughs> Edge and uh, Steve Austin have been out for. Um, it sounded like the same type of surgery Kurt Angle had. Uh, oh God, it's been over 10 years now that he had his uh, wow. neck surgery after Mania 19. Uh, meaning that probably tomorrow, uh, Stephanie will come out and strip him of the title officially because he's not able to defend it, and they'll figure out some way of crowning a new champion. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But good news is we don't have to deal with any more Daniel Bryan Kane matches because honestly, he should have been feuding with Orton and or Batista, mm -hmm. but they saw money in reforming Evolution for a couple months. Uh, and also what I alluded to last week, I was like, why hasn't even Marie been on uh, television? Simple answer, she's been off for a month, as has The Miz. They've been filming The Marine uh, 4. She's in The Marine 4 as some type of sniper. Because I saw this as um, there was a, a thing on the WWE that memes. Uh, that <laughs> there was something on the WWE memes. uh, uh they had a photo of Layla kissing uh, Fondango, and then Summer Rae with a sniper rifle. I was like, "That's pretty good Photoshop. How do they do that?" And then I realized, "Oh, it's it's a it's a shot of of that movie." Of the movie. <laughs> uh, she's expected to return in a couple weeks. Okay, now before we get into this episode again, let's talk about last week's episode. Uh, the only story point was Natty giving heartfelt paintings, badly, crudely drawn paintings to Nikki and Bree and them and their confessional saying, I didn't like it. This is ugly. Why the hell would I ever put this up anywhere? So this week, <laughs> and this constitute in, fuck you, bitch, we're going to have a match tonight. So the last two weeks, it's been Nikki Bella versus um, Natalia. Yeah. This, this, this week, SmackDown with Eva Marie as special guest referee. Even Maria is just a little boy. Yeah. So, yeah, so they're taking stuff that happened months ago and mm -hmm. putting it into the show. They probably watched it that Sunday. It's like, wait, they didn't like it? That bitch! It's like, well, you, this is the script we wrote up for you. It was landed like that. Oh, we forgot you give you Bella's script, too. Sorry. Bitch! <laughs> <laughs> so that's what's going on. And, like, here's the thing. It's almost like the Total Divas are in their own little storyline on television now. None of them are touching Paige. Thank God! <laughs> oh, we did get an Alicia Fox freak out, which I read online, and I'm just like, oh, is she shooting? She's like, I, like I've been working for this company. I was going to be the undefined diva of champions. Bullshit. No, no, that's a, that, that was the botch. Like, she was going to oh, be... No, okay. no, she's like, if there's any, if there's going to be an undefined champion of divas, and it's like, uh, you mean, uh... Uh, undefeated? Uh, no, not undefeated. Um, uh, undisputed. Oh. And she's undefined. Undefined. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, but then I watched the freak out. Like, I watched the highlight clips. So I was just like, that's nothing. Like, that's nothing. Like, mm -hmm. Miz came out, he got in the commentary thing. He's just like, I don't get a match, and just, like, and he walked out. Mm. No, at least he had that. So, anyway, uh, continuing on from last episode, uh, where we saw Oksana dropping the knee on Trinity and shattering her face. Uh, they took her right away to the doctor, went to go x-ray. Well, she's back in action anyway, so you all know the story. She's not going to need surgery. There's no sense in putting up this storyline. Her story bits in this are very, very, very short, because there's two other ones we had to deal with. And thankfully, all of them are all together, so no one has to split off. Mm -hmm. But yeah... She's just laid up in home. She doesn't need surgery. She was only out for the three weeks, which has sorrow since passed. But she is worried that she's not going to get that diva's that spot chance. at uh, exactly. Mania. Exactly. Which we already know what happened there. 
Everyone got thrown into a match. Nobody won, and they handed it to the girl that had talent. Paige. Precisely. So that AJ could take time off to heal nagging injuries and plan her wedding with CM Punk. Exactly. Uh, so yeah, that's true story. Anyway, um, so apparently, after the whole fiasco with Summer Rae uh, burying uh, Eva Marie on uh, Superstars, um, everyone goes off to Mexico for Bree's Bachelorette, and she's like, where's my invite? I'm like, Bitch, you've been here for four months. I don't think you've gotten into the invite. And then they're and then they're talking about it's like, oh yeah, even Marie, you know, when you first came on, uh, we were written in to hate you, but then it was us versus the rest of the divas, so we became faces. So oh, now we're good friends. Okay. Yeah. So this all this deals with uh, so it's Bree's bachelorette party. They're down. They're drinking all the time, mm -hmm. and apparently. Uh, Eva Marie is a recovering alcoholic, and she's one of those types that you can't have just one drink. You can't just have one to socialize. It's going to turn into another, 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 and yeah. then you're just, you know, you're... Spiral. Passed out uh, at the bottom of a, a bathroom stall. Which is kind of sad. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and the whole thing is, like, she didn't tell anyone until, like, midway to the end of the episode that she had this problem. She just kind of went with the flow and... Let everyone have fun. And every yeah, but the thing is, like, you can tell them right away and get um, and then get the fun going afterwards. Exactly. It's just like, uh, don't mean to bring you down her, but I just, just, like, I'm not drinking. I'm not a recovering alcoholic. I'm not <clears> drinking. <throat> I'm just going to drink water. And they're like, all right, that's fine. All right, let's go. And then it devolves later on into... They get to a bar, and she's... I'm slouching a lot. I'm gonna get back yeah, up here. Sit up a little bit. Um, she's uh, the partying, and she's just turning down shots and shots. Everyone's giving her stuff, and then she decides, "I you know what? I'm just gonna go home. You know, I'm not feeling it. I'm gonna go home." Uh, kind of, I kind of get that way, uh, but only after I've had a few drinks. Like, that's why I don't drink all the time. Um, cause I don't drink all the time too, but I know when I to have, stop. <laughs> I have weird fits though. If I start getting like really drunk, um, I kind of go into depression. So that's why I don't drink it. I try often. to make sure you don't even get to there. <laughs> well, the, it all depends on my mood. When we're in uh, uh, Buda Canada, Buda Canada, we were having so much. Yeah, fun. we're having fun. And yeah, that I was, was like, good. you know what? I'm safe to go like, continue drinking. And yeah. you know what? I had fun and I wasn't depressed. How can I be depressed with you there? <laughs> I guess you're right. Exactly. <laughs> uh, yeah, exactly. Who can de get depressed at this face? <laughs> I don't. I don't remember the guy who uh, made disparaging comments about um, her in the last video. But mm -hmm. yeah, there, buddy. Uh, Doesn't I matter. I deleted and bleep the Adiva's videos anymore. Well, I deleted and blocked him anyway. Anyway. Thank you. If you have constructive criticism, or if you want to have an arguing point about the show, fine. When you start calling her names, fuck you. You're gone. Uh, where was? Oh, yeah, okay. And here's another bombshell. Uh, apparently. Nikki Bella was married before. Shocker. <laughs> it was one of those, like, it was one of those, um, what is it? Uh, yeah, she was, like, 20 years old in one of those, like, high school, uh, weddings. Sweating, mm. uh, sweethearts. And it's like, hey, wouldn't it be fun if we got married? <laughs> Let's go oh, get married. Oh, little too many wobbly pups. <laughs> yeah, and they get married, and then they're just like, okay, see ya. Apparently, they never lived together. They different. They, they barely saw each other. And then when they started dating other people, they're just like, oh, shit, we're still married. We should probably go get an annulment. <laughs> Reminds me a lot of Britney Spears. Reminds me of that episode. It remembers of uh, Britney Spears when she married uh, Jason Alexander for, like, 59 uh, hours. the actor, per se. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been so funny. <laughs> that would have been funny. <laughs> if Britney Spears walks through that door, she will kill Independent George. <laughs> that was so funny. A George, the fighting within himself, cannot survive. <laughs> uh, I love old Seinfeld. Hate the finale. Worst finale. Oh, One of the worst finales ever. Like bad finales. <laughs> well, actually, uh, Watch Mojo made a top ten list of worst finales. Mm -hmm. uh, there's Sopranos, How I Met Your Mother, Dexter, Lost, Seinfeld. Uh, they gave an honorable mention to uh, Dinosaurs, which I thought was like the most depressing. Like it's a kid show, like you know, animatronic mm -hmm. dinosaurs, whatever. 
it ends with the Ice Age, and all the dinosaurs die. Dark. The last, like, the credits roll with, like, a bunch of snow coming down, and that old news reporter, Triceratops, or whatever it was, he was just like, and that's the end. Good, good night, and good luck. It's like, there you go, end of series. Everyone you love is dead. <laughs> I'm just imagining the baby dinosaur shivering, going, Not the mama. Oh. Diaper Nightmare first. fuel. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so, yeah, everyone's all worried because, like, it's a big dark secret nobody knows about, not even yeah. her family. And they're just like, oh, geez, what's John going to think? You're talking about all this marriage stuff. And, uh,. He's like, oh, well, why do you want to get married? You were married, and that was horrible, so I got married, and that was horrible. So why ever get married to anyone ever again? Sometimes second time is the charm. Yeah. In our case, first time. Permanent. Well, it worked for one of my relatives. So. Yeah. There. Yeah, so a party's going on. Uh, there's a... They go to... <clears throat> uh, fuck. They go to a club, and everyone's drinking, and then even Marie just leaves. She's just like, I can't handle this. Wow. It's just too much stimuli, and everyone's trying to force the stuff down <clears throat> me, and I'm saying no. So I'm just like, you know what? But she's doing so much, so well at controlling and controlling it. Yeah, and I'm like, impressed just, by her. Yeah, you, know, you know, go out, try to have a good time. If it's not working, yeah, have a good leave. time. Just give the drink to someone else. Yeah. So then everyone's pressured the next morning. She's like, "What's wrong?" She's like, oh, "I'm fine. I'm fine." She's like, "What's wrong?" "Oh, I'm fine." It's like, "What's wrong?" It's like, "Fine. I'm a recovery alcoholic. I can't handle it." And it just turns to this whole, like, everyone huddles together and then drops all this stuff. And it's like, I know what it's like to be dick. Like, that, this is the best with Natty. She's like, oh, I know, dear I know God, it's like, I had, I had to deal with that with my dad. It's like, no, your dad wasn't an alcoholic. It was probably a coke addict. I mean, it was the 80s. I mean, half the WWF roster was on coke. I mean, or look something. at any. <laughs> it's uh -oh. just like, uh -oh. <laughs> it's just like, uh, gotta get ready for my interview. The family that I live for! Oh, I bring to you! The smells of combat! With all of the face paint! I am the ultimate warrior! Ah, load the spaceship with the rocket fuel! Load it with the words! Oh god, I'm coming down! <laughs> well, Hulk Hogan and Macho Hogan and Macho Man were back for that too. They probably had a bit of coke before they did their promo. Oh like, Macho man, we need a promo from you. He's like, hang on one second there. <laughs> oh, Creep to the frame of the cup, right to the top, space is the place, and sky's the limit. Take it! Oh, God, I'm coming down. <laughs> That's how it was in the 80s. And I it's just like, I don't 80s. think you could have done anything for your dad. No, your dad was just like, Daddy, I'm fine! <laughs> <laughs> I try to remember. I'm pretty sure I th Jim Nine for uh, a Nine Heart uh, gimmick was he was the fat guy at the Heart Foundation. And he had a long ass beard and he cut promos that made no sense and he always laughed maniacally. That's what everyone did back in the eighties. Why does that sound like the Wyatts? Yeah, well, Wyatts conduct. Uh, oh, Bray anyway makes uh, speeches and promos that like make you think. It's got that long ass beard. Mm. Ooh, all right. Getting the hiccups here. All right, so so after the size session, everyone's like, "Oh, let's go do one of the natty things. Let's go swim with dolphins." But the funny thing was, like, natty was like, "Oh, I want to do like ocean stuff. I want to go swim with the dolphins. I want to play board games, and I want to go on zip lines." It's like, no, this weekend's all about getting drunk. Well, yes and no. I mean, you go to an all inclusive resort. If all you do is drink, then you're gonna have a crappy time. You're like, yeah. well, we went down. We went on that pirate expedition or that yeah. pirate uh, bedern. So trader. worth it. So <laughs> worth it. Went on shopping trip, it was fine. Then, yeah, because it's only gonna last a couple hours, and you can go right back to drinking. Exactly. Now, in most cases, tour boss, you just buy like they'll uh, they'll have stuff, and like people will come up with like little things, and just be like, it's like water, cola, cervezas. Hmm. Cervezas from the buck. Bus cervezas are like a buck, buck fifty, or fifty pesos, or something like that. You just pop that on, pop a beer, and drink it. We did that double decker buses down in Cuba. It was awesome. <laughs> So, yeah, anyway, they, they get through all that, and then uh, it cuts to N Nikki going to the the her Bell's family. Uh... Yeah, her brother got a new house, and mm -hmm. she drops the bombshell on them. They seemed okay with them. It's just like, I'm, uh, I was like, I'm done with that. Yeah, he's just like, this is bad, it's bad, but, like, you know, I hope John takes it better than I do. Mm -hmm. 
So now we cut to... Uh, that was pretty much it. That was pretty quick. Everything was kind of contained within uh, yeah. the Mexico stuff. They cut back to Trinity like once or twice just to be like, I get the eye patch. And she's like, this sucks. I was on my way to becoming Divas Champion. Yeah, you were. But thankfully they put the title on someone that deserves it. An actual wrestler. <laughs> um, so, yeah, after all that, then they go next week on a two-part Season finale. So it's going to be freaking two hours tomorrow or next week. It's going to deal with WrestleMania 30 week and Nikki and Brian, or sorry, Nikki, uh, Brie and Brian's uh, wedding. Babies. <laughs> as well as she, Nikki's going to drop the, the bombshell Baby on John. Brian. She's going to drop the bombshell on John. Uh, John about the wedding. I think like after the, the wedding... It was like, congratulations, he walks up to John's like, I know you know. He's like, I'm not going to do this here right now. <laughs> so let's just see how that happens, because they're still together, because, like, why would, unless it was because to hype up the show, why would Bray Wyatt cut the promo saying, it's like, go back to your mansion and live with the old Bobby doll. And then go back and it's like, oh, Nikki, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to mention you in a promo. It's like, yeah, you did. <laughs> Better to beg for forgiveness and ask for permission. Hmm. Uh, God, what else was there? Oh, yeah, uh, Bree telling Sam Ray, you're not invited to my wedding. I was like, well, I would think that would be obvious. Um, uh, everyone's like going, oh, it's WrestleMania, and we're all excited. And then Vicky, they show a clip of Vicky Rowe saying, you will defend your title against, and they bring out all the divas. Which, for some reason, she didn't say the entire divas division. Uh, suspense for next episode. I mean, Mania was like a month ago. We're all pretty much caught up to what's mm -hmm. going on right now. So I'm interesting if they go. It, 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 oh yes, they will. It's Friday. The Friday after Mania was the wedding, so maybe they'll do the Raw after Mania that none of the Total Divas are on. Like it's all AJ and Paige. Like AJ comes out and she's like for. 200 or 400 and some one days I've been your Divas champion. I'm the longest reigning champion in history. And then Paige comes out. She's like, I want to congratulate you. She's like, nah, I think you want a piece of me, right? Oh, no, I'm not ready. I, and then, like, two moves, pin, becomes Divas champion, which I thought was going to destroy Paige, but Paige seems to be doing okay. Thank God. <laughs> so, to all you haters out there, next week will be the last video of these. We'll, we'll be done. Because I know you don't want to do season three. I might show up every now and then, but not all the time. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll watch it, and I'll tweet and snark about it online, but I think as far as videos goes, next week will be the last one. Okay. I mean, you know, we got to get... people want us to do this again. <laughs> yeah, I'll leave it up to... I'll, I'll, I'll have a vote uh, in the comments of the next video. If you want these to continue, let us know. We'll do them. If I get no response, or if I get a bunch of eh, whatevers, we'll end it. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> two, <laughs> two hours of this tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, God. I know, two hours. Oh, my God. Are you trying to tickle my neck? Yes, with, your with the... <laughs> so anyway. I had to get him going. <laughs> Unless it's a joke or a speech. <laughs> Don't give away my, uh, secret. <laughs> it's a secret to everybody. <laughs> Don't tell anyone I'm giving you 100 rupees. Anyways, guys, I'm tired. I'm going. <laughs> uh, we'll see you next week for the finale. Well, let's hope we survive it. <laughs> Bye. Bye.